The Fiery Cross, the fifth book in Diana Gabaldon's Outlander series, continues the story of time-traveling World War II nurse Claire Randall Fraser and her 18th century Scots Highlander husband, Jamie Fraser. It is set in the pre-Revolutionary War era in the American colonies, primarily on Fraser's Ridge in North Carolina. The novel opens in October 1770 with the gathering at Mount Helicon, where all the Scottish clans come together for a festival that includes games, music, and dance. It's here that Jamie, now a colonel of the militia by order of the king, is instructed to unify the backcountry and prepare men for the looming war. Jamie and Claire's daughter, Brianna, is at the center of a major plotline when she weds Roger Mackenzie in a Scottish handfast ceremony. They have recently welcomed their son, Jeremiah, known as Jemmy. An unresolved question looms over the child's paternity, as Brianna had been raped by Stephen Bonnet, a notorious pirate and smuggler who remains a constant and threatening presence throughout the story. During the gathering, Claire and Jamie's lives are filled with rituals, politics, and the joys and trials of daily life on the ridge. Claire continues to use her medical knowledge to treat illnesses and injuries, blending modern medicine with herbal remedies available in the 18th century. Her medical practice becomes increasingly vital as both an influenza epidemic and Claire's own smallpox vaccination campaign make their rounds through the community. Roger, struggling with his place in the 18th century as a man with no real traditional talents or standing, works to establish himself and gain Jamie's respect. His dedication to his new family and the community eventually earns him a position within the Ridge and the larger settler society. Tensions rise when political unrest turns into action. Jamie is called to lead a militia against the Regulators, a group of farmers and settlers who oppose the corrupt taxation system imposed by the colonial government. This leads to the Battle of Alamance, where Jamie is forced to fight against his godfather, Murtag Fitzgibbons Fraser, who is a leader of the Regulators. The conflict ends tragically with Murdaugh's death, which deeply affects Jamie. Throughout the book, Gabaldon develops several secondary characters and their stories. Fergus, Jamie's adopted son, and his wife Marsali experience the struggle and joy of expanding their family. Meanwhile, young Ian Murray returns from living with the Mohawk tribe, bringing with him a dog named Rollo and carrying personal pain and secrets from his time with the Native Americans. Stephen Bonnet's story also progresses. He abducts Brianna with the intention of claiming Jemmy as his heir. Brianna manages to turn the tables on Bonnet, leading to his capture. In a tense trial, Bonnet is sentenced to death by drowning. However, execution by such a method is said to be a merciful fate. Knowing his fear of drowning, Brianna shoots him herself, ensuring his death and confronting her trauma. As the threat of war escalates, Claire and Jamie are aware that the Revolutionary War is inevitable. They must navigate their loyalty to the crown while foreseeing the inevitability of American independence and the impact this will have on their lives and their family's future. Claire's knowledge of the future becomes an increasingly complex ethical dilemma as she must decide when to intervene and when to allow history to take its course. The Fraser family endures other trials, including kidnappings, a snakebite endangering Jamie's life, and personal losses. Claire is accused of witchcraft, and the legal and societal structures of the time present looming threats. Through it all, the strength of the Fraser family and their community ties are tested, as they face challenges from nature, neighbors, and the looming conflict. The Fiery Cross delves into themes like loyalty, honor, family, the advancement of medical science, and the complexities of living at the edge of a revolution. It presents a detailed tapestry of historical events and the impact they have on everyday lives, all while continuing the saga of the Fraser family and their enduring love and commitment to each other through time. You can listen to the full audiobook for free by following the URL in the description.